Hey, how's it going guys? Computer Madman here, and welcome back to a tutorial video. Now, uh, I'm sorry that I haven't uploaded in quite a while. I mean, my last video was like four months ago. I just haven't really been getting into YouTube recently, and I haven't thought of stuff to do. But I thought of a new tutorial today, and this tutorial today is how to um, stop your YouTube buffering. So say if you have a very bad connection, and you're getting some bad buffering on your videos, I'm going to show you how to stop it. So I have four tips. Uh, the first one is what you're going to do is right down here in settings, you have quality. Now, the, the higher the quality, the obvious the longer it's going to take to buffer. So what I usually do is go for 360p um, or either what I will tend to do is sometimes if the connection is really bad, go to 240p, although 240p is like shocking to be honest. 480 if your connection can handle it, but 360p, I would say, uh, is a good start for your uh, is a good start for the first tip. Um, another tip as well is to pause the video uh, right at the beginning of the video before playing it back. So basically, what you do is you pause the video, so you let it buffer further ahead. So I'm just going to show you quickly. Once I refresh uh, <coughs> the page, this is actually my video before. So yeah, just wait for the video to load, pause, and then as you'll see, it will start buffering. Make sure every time you load it that you do turn the quality down um, as well. And as you can see, look how far uh, how fast it buffers. And then once it buffers enough, then that's when you know you can start playing it back video format so you could just do so this is one of my old videos by the way like I said so what you could do is just say you could pause the video wait for it to buffer you could go I don't know go downstairs get a drink get get some food or something and then come back up and then you can um, start playing back your video as the as it will have buffered enough so you can watch it uh, the next clip is play in a smaller video size now for a small video size basically if you play in the small screen as it is now like I am on my laptop this is the smallest size you can get then we have cinema mode which I don't think is actually much bigger than the original apart from it just has black bars on the outside just to make it look wider but if you go full screen um, this will mean that your buffer speeds are going to take longer so I'm just going to go on to uh, 720p and I'll show you what I mean show you what I mean it might take a while I'm not sure so as you can see it is actually it is, it's going up relatively quick but that's because this is just a tutorial video if it was say a gaming video it would take a lot longer but now if I go down here to uh, 360p which is the one I recommended this will shoot up and look the the Buffering is actually flying right now, so that's why I go to 360p, and it's best to play in a smaller size. What and the other thing as well, um, if you did not know this, if you actually buffer a clip in the small screen size like this, as you can see, I'm in the small screen. Um, let me just put it on 720p quick, and then I can show you what I mean. So it's buffering here, right? Let me just wait for it to get to the end. Come on. I mean, my connection isn't bad for YouTube, but yours might be, so that's why you're obviously looking at this video. Come on. Okay, so it just wants to stay there. Okay. But look, if I actually go to full screen now, as you can see, the buffering is still here. So even if you let it buffer in a smaller screen, you can then enlarge it to a big screen, and you do not have to rebuffer. The only way you'd have to rebuffer is if you change the quality. And for the last tip, is uh, simply use the device with a better Wi-Fi signal. So if you have a phone, obviously a phone is going to have not such a good antenna as, say, on a laptop. Because I'm on my laptop. If I was on my tablet or my phone, my connection would be buffering like crazy up here. And I'd have to play it in like the small screen. So if you're on a phone, you will get poorer connection and you will obviously get buffering unless you play it in a small screen on a low quality then that's what you want to do but phone 
tablet could be a bit iffy with buffering but if you're on a laptop or say a tower PC connect through ethernet cable this it will absolutely work fine for you so that's all for the video I hope you guys have enjoyed this video please do like comment rate and subscribe if this helped you out uh, it definitely helps me out a lot so yeah I will see you guys in the next one bye guys